Hey guys, and welcome to episode one of Tony Kaku Kawaii, and that's exactly what I'm expecting this series to be. I'm hoping that it will be a very kawaii romance, along with a nice sprinkle of feels in there. So I quite look forward to this series. I honestly don't know what's kind of in store for us, so I'm looking forward to it. So without further ado, let's get into things. If you guys want to watch full anime, make sure to check out the link above, or else we'll be starting the video in three, two, one, go. Oh no. What's with the tinkly music? The kid be dead. Okay. <laughs> This this just caught me so off guard. Are, are you okay as well? You're bleeding. My wife ever spoke to me. <laughs> the fuck is going on? Okay, is this, is this the opening? Oh, what a great way to transition into the... Oh, Penny. I'm sorry. I'm a little speechless on the way we left off, but this is uh, oh, this this series is gonna make me cry, isn't it? Yep. I I have a mixture of feelings going on because you know I just watched these guys both bleeding from the. This opening is absolutely adorable. Um. Bleeding from the bleeding, bleeding to death, and now we just have a really wholesome looking opening. I wonder why they split the panels up like this. I know it's like the pink and blue, the guy and the girl. Why do I feel like there's just like a barrier that's keeping the fly me to the moon? I, I would jam to this. This is like really adorable. Um, but. Yeah, looking at the opening, it does look like there is kind of split panels and I feel like, sorry, fly me to the moon. I feel like maybe there's something separating these two. Oh no, but then there are connected here and... <laughs> Wait, how old are you guys? Do we start off with marriage? I, <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. Where are we going? Okay. Sure. NASA! Zaki NASA. What's, what's wrong with... I don't get what's wrong with like Starry Star. Is it because he's like NASA? Or is it because everyone keeps forcing... Well, sweetie, he can be whatever the hell he wants. So, you know what? Let's not get sassy to it like a five-year-old. Gotcha. Oh. <laughs> Success. <laughs> He's going to be better than NASA. Top 30%. But. Fabulous. I'm so confident. <laughs> The sensei. Mm. 
this why do I feel like he's going to fail May or maybe not you know he is the fabulous Nessa <laughs> You never know what fate has in store for you. That was kind of dark for Shadowy. He's so like a bee. I didn't expect that kind of. <gasps> this is the day you die. Oh no. <gasps> it's a truck. Gun? I see the motherfucking truck. I'm watching you. Okay, no, it wasn't that truck. That's the girl that saves you. The fate that awaited me. I'm uneasy because I know you're going to die in three, two, one, one and a half, and now. Where the fuck? Oh, what's truck gonna okay. came? Does our main guy die in episode one? Jesus. I think she saved you. No, call the fucking ambulance. Sorry. <laughs> when you got in front of him. Is she the moon? Princess Kaguya. I know the myth. If you let her go, you may never see her again. Miracles don't happen twice. Oh my god, he rose! <laughs> wow. The power of the boner has risen. <laughs> I love how that elephant noise went off as well. What am I meant to be feeling right now? Like the power of the boner, the power of the boner. <laughs> Someone, I, I guess he's fine. I, I guess that's not, well, I guess that truck comes fine. Didn't do a Sisekai job properly, but you know. Or maybe he's dead. No, 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 no. He did talk to the guy. But it did say that she took majority of the hit of the car, but she's perfectly fine. So she's not a normal... No. Like she's fine. She's so completely fine. <gasps> it's just a smell of Rachel.
Relax, relax. She's just trying to warn you up. No stripping in public yet. Yet. <laughs> It's always the scent. Yeah, can we can we send this can we please send him to the hospital to get checked up? Yeah, not fine. Not fine. Both of your legs are broken. Oh, sweetie. Once the adrenaline runs out. He ran on pure adrenaline. Why does she keep saying like a goodbye, you know, like as a, a goodbye forever? The power of love, man. Like, um, this... He's back up! This guy's a motherfucking zombie! And chase after them and try to get them back. I love you. Okay. Oh, <gasps> the slow mo snow. Where is this going? Huh? <laughs> this could be a huge scam that this child is going into, but obviously I don't think that will be the case. Oh! That was a that was a hard fucking ball. How long has it been? You would have died. How is she how is she not dead? You're married. No, she said she would marry you. No, no, no. I think she just lives in a different era where it goes marriage, dating. Yeah. And end up losing that year. Oh. Did you get it? And declined the offer, I go. But the day never came. This feels so empty. Wait, legal age for marriage? Would she just be like, kabam? It's her. This is the tale of... It's your waifu! I don't know what that was. <laughs> Like our marriage. <gasps> and the story of a married couple. I love how the moon always shines brightest when she's there. What do you mean, your waifu and husband? 
my thoughts were on. <laughs> hey, at least you've been faithful throughout those years. We, we get it, sweetie. The whole point, what does this smell? Where have you been? Is this the marriage papers? Oh. Yeah. I am liking these like over the top kind of comedic effects. I told you this was going to be a big scam. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wow, this is actually going down. Who was the witness? <laughs> She's so prepared. He's so happy. Um yeah just <laughs> oh for fuck's sake <laughs> i love this reaction just the fact he's like fuck it i don't care if it's a scam It does. It really does. I put my fate in you. Why did she want to specifically get married? I feel like there's like a little hint of mystery going on. Where are you going? To the moon? Oh, the board office. Oh, yeah, this. She seems very eager to get married. 24 hours? Nice, nice. She knows a lot. Use a casa, casa. It does. It matches so well. I think it's a cool name. She's like one of those people that knows so many like random facts. Really detailed random facts. The 
fly me to the moon. I think it's a fantastic name. She already healed your heart, sweetie. Uh oh. Oh, prepare. So prepared. What a sweet talker. Congratulations on your marriage. Oh, hooray. <laughs> yeah, it feels surreal, doesn't it? I love the, um, unprotected hand holding. How dare you now? <laughs> well, they're married. I love, I just love the, the steps though. <laughs> oh, geez. This is marriage. That's right. <laughs> All I can grab. Ow. <laughs> I love the, all I can grab. Yeah, does it sound? Did he say that out loud? Yeah, this ain't no buffet. But I mean, it could be an all you could eat fiesta. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna stop being a pervert. <laughs> oh. with an irreplaceable bond between them. Where are you going? Where do you keep disappearing to? No, because we're married, we sleep together. Sorry, sorry. So, stop being a pervert. Where are you going this late at night? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Are you going to the moon and back? Oh, She keeps walking off into the moon. <laughs> I, where, where do I even begin explaining this? So, so, okay. I must be living in the old era because now it's you get married and then you hold hands and then you sleep on the same bed. I thought, you know, you normally, you know, date, you know, meet the person, get to know. No, 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 You skip all that shit now. You just get straight to marriage and then the all you can grab buffet. You know, as I mentioned at the start, I wasn't sure like exactly what I was getting into. You know, I thought this could be like, you know, a wholesome sweet romance or a sprinkle of feels. But no, this has like a brilliant aspect of like comedy, derpiness. I mean, what other romance anime have you seen where they get married within the first episode? Like, you know, normally it takes a whole fucking season for them to hold hands. Cough, cough, Kaguya, I'm looking at you. But no, this anime is like, they get married within the first episode and then we do the hold handing later on. And I thought that was a really unique 
unique take on it. It was so unexpected. Like I knew through the summary that they were going to get married, but I didn't expect it to move on so quickly. You know, we started off him still, I think in high school, trying to apply for university, but then, you know, Truck Kun came along. And I guess for the first time in ever, do I dare say that Truck Kun actually was the best freaking wingman. So like, thank you Truck Kun for not like killing us and isekai us, but instead just brutally grazing us for us to find our waifu. So like, you know, we gotta give MVPs to Truck Kuns. They appear every solid episode. And this one, I definitely have to give MVP for the best freaking wingman. Cause seriously, Truck Kun should have been at the wedding considering it is Truck Kun that got them two together. So MVP to Truck Kun, let's all give applause. Round of applause to Truck Kun. But yeah, honestly, I am liking this really like trollness of the anime. I think it works with the animation style as well. Like when we see the guy in his like kind of funky face mode and then the whole house shaking kind of thing. It all works, like it really does. And I also can't wait to see how this kind of like bond and relationship will develop concerning, you know, they are a married couple now. What fun occurrences will happen with them now living together? And I also feel like there is a little hint of mystery as well, or just like I feel like there is something we are going to explore in regards to this girl who, you know, appeared out of nowhere and was able to save our boy Nasa. Because they mentioned how she took the full force of the hit, but she was completely fine. So that does give us a kind of mysteriousness about her. And concerning that every time she walks towards the moon, and concerning, you know, the title of the anime is Fly Me to the Moon, I, I wonder what she will kind of be all about. And maybe that's the reason why she asked for marriage first instead of dating. So I think lots to explore there, along with the fact that just experiencing their relationship kind of grow, I think it's also going to be a really enjoyable aspect. So yeah, I'm quite looking forward to the series. If you guys do want to see a reaction to episode two, do make sure to like this video and leave a comment below. But I guess until then, make sure you guys stay awesome and I'll definitely catch you guys next time.